also has been called the luckiest dog, and while they, that may be true, he comes from a traumatic past. He has been injured and is blind, but that's only made rescue organizations try harder to help. KRBC's John McMichael sits down with Arlo and gets to know him. I'm up here at Abilene Arrow with Arlo the dog who's just flown in from Houston. Volunteers have been transporting Arlo, a blind dog from a traumatic past all over the country, and Abilene hopefully is one of his last stops. Um, Rescue the Animals is going to do a little bit of work on him to give him heartworm treatment and then find him a place to go with a family that's going to take care of him. We will take him in, house him, get him treated for heartworms, any other medical that he needs until we can find him a home and in another rescue. And it's amazing the uh, links that animal lovers will go to to save a dog and get it a new home. And while the story may seem extraordinary from an outsider's point of view, it's everyday activity for organizations like Rescue the Animals and Pilots and Paws, which is a group that's dedicating to flying animals where they need to go. Reporting with this beautiful, precious, little, bouncing baby boy of a dog, I'm John McMichael, KRBC News. Okay, thank you, John. Arlo has been on the road with a number of volunteers, taking him from place to place for treatment, and hopefully this will be one of the last stops before he will find a forever home. And we're going to have more on this story coming up tonight at 10.